my god what a great news from microsoft microsoft announces windows 11 on arm development kit with Qualcomm SoC. This one is Microsoft's first desktop PC which arrives in the form of ARM development kit. Microsoft has announced this new hardware at the build 2022. This developer kit is designed to help developers to build apps that take advantage of new AI capabilities. They are introducing a new NPU that is Neural Processing Unit on board. And this great hardware supports Windows 11 on ARM. Project Voltera is powered by an yet unnamed Snapdragon processor. Device resembles a mini desktop PC similar to in the shape of Mac Mini. Although this developer kit is Microsoft's first desktop PC, though they are not planning to sell this device as a consumer product. Talking about the hardware specs, we have little to no details to share but Based on their previous partnership with Qualcomm, this development kit will be more likely integrated with a flagship Qualcomm SoC. Additionally, Qualcomm has announced a new Qualcomm Neural Processing SDK for Windows Toolkit, which will truly help the developers to explore AI development in their apps and this time Microsoft is committed to integrate the support for NPUs into their end-to-end -end Windows platform as well. This end-to-end -end software development kit will be ARM native with some of the tools launching in preview soon. ARM native tool chain consists of Visual Studio 2022, Visual Studio Code, Visual C++, Windows Subsystem for Linux, Windows Subsystem for Android, .NET, .NET 6 and Java. No doubt for Windows, Microsoft is committed to open hardware ecosystem. And to support new hardware platforms and technologies such as GPU renderer, also Wi-Fi and cellular chipsets and a CPU including MIPS, x86, Alpha, Itanium and x64. What we can see right over here, Microsoft is going all into Windows on ARM and they want it to be just another option for Windows customers. And with the up coming flagship Qualcomm Snapdragon SoC, I think we are really close to reach that aim. So what do you think about Project Volterra? Apart from the development use, will this be a great gaming device? Talking about the ports, we got Ethernet, USB, also we got Type-C ports as well. Also the stackable design do makes it a really interesting option as a mini desktop PC. So what do you think about it? Do let me know in the comments down below. Make sure to hit that like, share this video, subscribe to our channel and this is Kedar from How to Guys signing out.